Hey Internet, my name is Abby and welcome back to Kerbal Space Program on Wings. Last time we landed successfully on the moon and I did a little bit science on the way to the moon. And today it's more about exploring the moon and doing some more science here. So I will do at first my log temperature from temperature scan from Moon's East Farside crater. Collected and recorded temperature data from the environment. Okay, not very interesting uh, um, information, but it's it and it is an information like this. Okay. So the next thing is I want to do the mystery goo. Observe mystery goo. The goo seems to be less dense here. Okay. And I will keep that data. I will do the next uh, mystery goo right away. So the goo, same information. Okay, let's keep it. And I have also my science junior. Let's have a look here. You leave the sample bay doors open on the moon and go do something else for a while. Okay, 100 science. This is amazing. And I really like this. this um, the science junior. I'm not quite sure about this radioactive symbol here. If it's really, really good to to add the science junior right under my capsule. But on the other hand, um, it's looking so much interesting. And if you see these wires and the okay, the radioactive thing is maybe a little bit concerning. But uh, the wires and the the interesting colors and the buttons. This is really interesting. I really like this. Okay. So, so much about this. Um, what else? I can do a crew report. You record the crew's assessment of the situation. 20 science. Wow, amazing. Let's keep the data. Okay, and now come the, the best and most important part because we want to do an EVA. Okay. Let's switch on the lights to make it more dramatic and zoom very close to it. Okay, here it comes. Only one small step for a Kerbal, but a giant leap for Kerbal kind. Release, and we are on the surface of Moon. And are we enjoying it? Yes, we are enjoying it. Woo! Yeah, amazing. We're on the surface of the moon. Haha. <laughs> we made it. We finally made it with our career mode, with our little rocket. I'm pretty much overwhelmed of the capacity of my or the capability of my um, rocket here, because I wasn't sure or I haven't thought that as I bought, uh, built this this next gen rec rocket in the episode as I was flying in orbit around the moon that is so powerful that I can even land with it on the moon and as we can see it is powerful enough we can do this. So um, I like to do I like to do an EVA report. The dust is getting ev everywhere. 32 signs. Let's keep that data. And I want to take a surface sample. Surface sample from Moon's East Farside crater. This crater seems to have been a really nasty impact. The samples have high um, samples are heavier than normal. Okay, 120 signs. Amazing. Let's keep it. And of course, we want to celebrate our first Moon landing with a flag. So let's plant the flag here. And okay, there is my flag. Site name. First moon landing. Okay. Um, plug text. What do I write on the plague? Ha. Huh. Um. I was here. Ah, no, that's that's not. We came in peace. This is much better. Okay, let's save this. So we are on the moon. Where are we? Let's have a closer look. We are right in the center of this this huge crater. Okay, I don't think I can fly with my EVA pack to a different biome. So I think I need to stay here. 
but well at first let me do a short quick save and then I like to fly up here to have a look where do I want to fly I think I will fly over there let's have a look if we can see something interesting but I don't think so I think we are pretty much stuck here right and oh, 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 oh careful careful what are you doing ouch ah uh, come come on and I'm happy he is enjoying it okay so let's let's take off again we and we are flying on the moon amazing ha <laughs> ha this is great I really like the moon I I'm all the time pretty happy if I am on the moon and if I can fly around here with my jetpack and my EVA pack and explore a bit the landscape and have some fun and so on so let's land here again okay and review report okay uh, I don't think I can do anything else so I will just fly back home to my rocket after I did all the exploration ah, can I if I do another recording with one of the lower temperature instrument and I put one into the capsule then I have also the the other one on the uh, on the side of my capsule capsule will this give me are uh, additional signs this might be interesting I need to figure that out so let me at first go back to my capsule and well, let's grab and climb all the way up so let's store the experiments and let's board okay I don't think I can do an barometer no of course not but what about the temperature log temperature from east far side let's keep it I have the same data here yes okay let's do an EVA and climb down can I reach it from the ladder I don't think so let's have a look Oh, take data. So temperature scan from Moon's East Farsight crater added. Port. Okay, now I have 11 stored data. Wow, this is amazing. Okay. We planted our flag. We did a lot of science. So I don't think I can do anything else and I don't think I have enough fuel to land on a different biome so the only thing I can do right now is leave the moon again and fly back home to Kerbin. So am I well prepared? Have I forgot anything? We have the flag down here. Let's do another EVA just in case. We have the flag down here. I have done my EVA report. I think... Oh. I think we are well prepared. Let's read the plague. We came in peace. Yes. Okay. Let's walk around. Okay, I think we've done everything what we need to do here. And let's climb back up. Yeah, board. Okay, I think I've done everything what I need to do on the moon. So now we can think about returning back to Kerbin. Can we see? No, we are on the far side. We can't see Kerbin from here. 
So I will head over to the 90 degree mark. Let me at first retract our ladders. I have a bit fuel in here, that's good. So okay, you're ready, let's do a quick save and let's roll up in 3, 2, 1 and full throttle. And we are aiming at the 90 degree mark, okay well done. And we are out of fuel. What about our apoapsis? Five kilometers. We need a bit. We are need a much higher or a bit higher apoapsis. So at first, let me ditch the stage and switch on the engine. So goodbye, stage. Was nice to meet you. And let's roll up again. Seven. 8, 9, 10. 10 is, is good enough. Okay, so 10 kilometers. Let's prepare. Let's do our... prepare our orbit. Um, oh, that's too much. Way too much. 61. Oh, that's too less. 10 to 23, a bit much. 16, 12, 8. 8, 10, 16. 9. Well, okay, something like this. Wow, now it's pretty agile. So. I hope I have enough fuel to return back, but I think so. I, I need to, to have enough fuel to do so, to return back to Kerbin. So the maneuver node is coming now. And burn in 3, 2, 1 and burn. And we are flying high above the surface. Or not high above the surface. Can I do a different crew report? Uh, no, 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 no. Cancel. Don't overwrite it. So what have we done so far? Let me have a look. 11 to 8. Need a bit more. 9. 9, 10, 10 to 11, okay, this is good. We have a nice circular orbit around the moon and we are also closing into a good position from where we can do our uh, return burn. Let's do this, no, that's too much. 67, let me adjust a bit my maneuver node. 42, a bit much. 30, this is good, this is really good. So, now we are flying across the surface. This is amazing. Can I do another EVA just... Oh no, crap! Our EVA report, no, nothing new. And I reset my maneuver node, or I hate this. Why I can't save my maneuver node or do anything like this? Now I need to to play around again. Can I? Let's figure this out. Maybe here. Five kilometers. Forty-three. Thirty-two. Okay. The rest comes when we are doing our burn. So we are uh, flying high above the or above the Muna surface. This is amazing, and I'm enjoying this. This is am amazing as well. So let's first forward a bit in time, so we can reach our maneuver node. And 
five. Oh, there's Kerbin. Kerbin has risen above the horizon of moon. One minute. Let's have a break here. We need to find our maneuver node. It's up here. Okay, very good. So there's the the our Kerbin. Could we see Minmus? Ike? No. Minmus, Minmus, Minmus. Minmus is on the other side. There. There's a little tiny dot. This could be Minmus. Okay, we can see Minmus as well. We will fly up to Minmus in the... Maybe in the next episode or something like this. So Minmus is our next goal. Because I want to explore Minmus, they have added some, some more biomes and I want to explore all the new biomes and I want to know which biomes they have implemented and so on. Okay, my burn is coming up, so let's full throttle. And I want to to see all the different biomes and explore the different biomes, so uh, I'm really looking forward to, to visit Minmus. I could have visited Minmus already with the very first items or very first rocket parts I had. But I, I really like to do a more uh, linear progress and do uh, a very short suborbital rocket flight and so on, and reach from this point on my my uh, destinations and my the other celestial bodies instead of just getting a huge amount of science in one go. This is not so my my way of playing the game. Maybe I would do this if I would uh, restart the career mode again, but this is the very first time that I'm recording the career mode, so I like to enjoy it a bit more. And now we have finished our burn. This is good. We have still a little bit fuel left. So now it's time to... I will just make a short maneuver note up here. Okay, let's frost forward in time. Goodbye, Moon. Was nice to land on you. There we have the sun again. And we are coming at our maneuver node. And the nav ball has switched around. We are now on our trajectory towards Kerbin. Let's have a quick save just in case. The sun is very bright. Can we still see Minmus? I'm not sure. Well, I... Oh, yes, there is Minmus. Over there is Minmus, okay. So, let's fast forward in time again. And move closer to Kerbin as it rotates around its own axis. And now we can see a little bit closer the Minmus. And we are coming around. Oh, I think we will land on the nighttime side. This is sad. So, where are we? Uh, maybe we will land on the... On the, sur on the ground, on normal ground. I hope we don't land in the mountain region. Well, let's see. Let's fast forward a bit in time again. As we are coming closer to the surface, or not to the surface, but to, to Kerbin. And let's have a break here. Okay. 80 kilometers. Yes, I think we will land on the surface, or not on the, yes, on the surface, and on the land, or not in the ocean. But I think that's okay. Let's... Woo! It's pretty agile. Let's prepare for our re-entry into the atmosphere of Kerbin. I have still a little bit fuel left, so I can use also the fuel to, to reduce my velocity when I'm um, slowing down with my parachutes so that my um, my spacecraft doesn't get ripped apart or have any trouble. Okay, only 50 kilometers. We are now coming in and I'm still enjoying it. Let's have a look inside. So we are pretty fast. Over 3 kilometers per second. 
as we are approaching Corbin's atmosphere and now it starts to to slow down a bit so we are in the atmosphere can we see some re-entry effects from this position I don't think so but from this position we can see the beautiful re-entry effects as we are glowing in heat and friction as we enter the atmosphere okay we are slowing down this is good I'm a bit concerned because this is looking a bit like a mountainous region and I don't really like to land in, in the mountains but maybe we are lucky and we can fly above it and across it so we can land in a more safer region we are a huge fireball at the horizon or at the sky of Kerbin and we are still descending that's good, that's really good and well I'm not not very happy about returning back to to the surface of Kerbin but we need the precious science we we need to return because we want to have the science we can't uh, just do nothing and let us keep in orbit and uh, remain in orbit but we can build maybe a station where we can remain in orbit this would be also interesting unfortunately um I think I I'm not quite sure about the 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 stations in the career mode because you can do uh, most of the experiments only once or maybe twice and then you are finished with the um, experiment so if I built a nice station up there I can dock to it and so on but I don't can gather any additional signs from it I can fly around the I can remain in orbit around Kerbin or around uh, another celestial body but in the end I don't can gather any signs from it and this is a little bit sad it would be more interesting if I could have some some experiments I can use uh, with my station so or what for I I need a station to to do these experiments. So this would be really interesting if we can have something like this or if something like this would be implemented. But um I still think about building a station just to have a station and to have something to dock or to refuel and to to have some fun with the station. So I I really think about doing something like this. And now we are closing in. This is good now let's deploy our chutes and I like to help a little bit my chutes to to slow down my spacecraft let's have a look from the interior we are still pretty high now our radar altitude starts to move let's turn towards our retrograde vector okay I like to slow down even a bit more and now the shoots should have deployed yes very good now let's extend our landing gear and we are coming down towards the surface this is good but I think we are a little bit too fast but luck un uh, fortunately I have some fuel left so I can slow down my spacecraft a little bit like the the Soyuz capsule with its uh, landing rockets when they are firing just before they they uh, hit the ground to to slow down even more a bit I can do almost the same with my um, rocket here I have still some fuel left so I can slow down my my descent as well and uh, have a hopefully gently landing with my rocket without destroying it or without having any other problems so we are only 200 meters high so we should have our landing from our first moon mission in a short amount of time 
and we are coming down and we are getting closer and closer to the gr surface okay I think now it's time to throttle up a bit to have a very very gently landing like this amazing well done well done good job good job okay we need to explore a bit our uh, landing area but at first let's do a quick save so EVA and let's have our lights on and release we are smiling we are happy we are back on the surface let's have a look take surface sample from Kerbin's grasslands okay let's keep the data EVA report we already done this so let's uh, reset this and I want to plant a flex this time again landing site uh, first first moon mission first moon landing uh, we did some science yes well done okay now I've also another tiny amount of grassland probe let's grab this and climb back up into the our capsule like this so board and let's recover our vessel and let's see what we got from our immune mission okay 18 experiments recovered for a total of 439 science so the crew report 20 science atmospheric pressure atmospheric pressure atmospheric pressure temperature sc uh, scan while near carbon uh, what else while flying over carbon shores from the launch pad temperature upper scan uh, upper atmosphere temperature sca scan while in space near the moon surface sample from the moon's east far side crater 120 science oh EVA report temperature scan from it surface sample from Kerbin's grasslands material studies 100 science amazing mystery goo mystery goo oh only 9 9.9 9.2 science for the second time this is this is uh, a hard decrease in science and a temperature scan without any science okay and the recovery of a uh, vessel returned from the surface of the moon 30 science okay done very good very good let's go over here so what do we have what can do can we have here can we have some other experiments we can have some larger batteries and greater solar panels tiny engines some wheels landing gear i have 490 signs i can i think i will build I think I will build a plane. Oh yes, I have some reaction wheels. And there is the other reaction wheel I like to have. I think I will build also a plane in the upcoming episode. So I will have the the wings or not the wings, the the landing gears. Let's research it. What do we have here? Greater landing struts are oh, not so important. So I like to have the re reaction wheels. Let me research this thing. And I want to build a space plane, a very basic one, so we can explore a bit more about around our our launch pad. Let's research this thing. What else we can have? Some more space plane or airplane parts. This is good. Some batteries. Wheels aren't as important, I think. So I think I will research these batteries 
in the hope that I can find something else here. Let's research it, yes. So, more batteries. And now we have here the seismic accelerometer. This is amazing. 300 signs. Okay, I don't have so much signs. And still the wheels, landing gear, the little things. Um, greater parts. This is nice. Few lines. What do we have here? Huge tanks. More advanced tanks. I'm not sure if I really need these ones. I would like to save some science for more science instruments. So I don't think I will research this thing right away. I really like to have some docking ports, but currently I don't have some docking ports. Or do I have some docking ports already? I don't think so. Let me have a look here. No, I don't think that I have docking ports. So I'll have to, to gather some more signs. Oh, we have now a lot of signs. Um, let me have a look. Moon. Situations. Surface landed. I can have some more signs from the material study and from the surface sample. Okay. The other ones are done. This is good. Okay, so next thing is maybe space or airplane or um, Minmus. Yes, I'm not quite sure if I go to Minmus or to or if I do an airplane mission at first. But at least we have some some more things to do, and we return from the moon. It was amazing mission. I really enjoyed to land on the moon with a with a rocket again because in the last episodes or in the the last time I was only doing um, space plane missions, and now to land with a rocket again with a normal lander on the moon was pretty refreshing, and I really enjoyed it. I hope you enjoyed this as well. If you do so, please like my video on YouTube, please become a subscriber of my YouTube channel and please leave me a comment what you think about Kerbal Space Program and I hope I see you again in the next episode when we do some more experiments, maybe uh, airplane or maybe a Minmus mission, we will see. Until then, my name is Evi. see you!